Hello everyone and welcome to Expedition AEP. My name is Justin Hunley. I am the Regional Market Manager over the state of North Dakota. And today we're going to be talking about some of the changes to expect for this upcoming plan year. Now North Dakota uh, historically has been a very cost plan dominant market, but we're starting to see more members gravitate towards Medicare Advantage plans every single year. And I don't expect 2023 to disappoint. Uh, Aetna, is, we'll just dive straight into them first. Uh, Aetna's mission is to put people at the center of everything they do while making decisions based on integrity, caring, excellence, and inspiration. Uh, for this upcoming year, you're, we're going to see a little bit of disruption with the Elite and Premier products expanding into 18 new counties. Uh, all of their plans have $0 PCP copays, um, $0 copays on Tier 1 drugs, and a $0 RX deductible as well. Uh, they are enhancing their formulary with over 500 positive tiering changes for 2023. Uh, they've enhanced supplemental benefits, uh, including like their dental, dental vision hearing over the counter and meals uh, on all plans. Uh, dental coverage uh, is going to be available that allows the member to choose in or out of network dentists uh, with just some additional savings for staying in the network. Now, all plans are going to offer a tra travel benefit uh, as well. This is an additional six months of coverage when out of the service area. We'll dive straight into uh, what United Healthcare is doing for, doing for this upcoming uh, selling season. UHC, it's simple. They're dedicated to helping people live healthier lives and making the health system work better for everyone. They've invested into their already competitive plans, increasing dental benefits up to uh, $2,500 on a lot of plans with a 0% or 0% copay. <laughs> Lower their max out of pockets uh, to $4,900 on the Patriot plan. Uh, with some additional benefits, they're increasing the Part B get back to $60 and lowering the PCP copay there as well. Uh, they're also implementing post discharge mills on all plans. Uh, this is a $0 copay uh, for 28 mills over 14 days, and this is unlimited times per year. Uh, we'll see some disruption with them as well. So the, their $0 premium choice plan is expanding into 18 new counties, while their $25 premium choice is expanding into 10 new counties. And the Patriot plan, as we talked about earlier, is expanding into 28 new counties as well. Humana is uh, coming in very competitive this year in a lot of markets, and they're looking to do that in North Dakota as well. Uh, they're introducing a new $0 plan. Uh, it's, this is a PPO that's going to be available in 30 counties. Uh, they've got a new Part B premium give back plan available. Uh, looks like they're enhancing their dental allowance benefits on a lot of their PPO plans as well, so that's exciting. Uh, they're going to be implementing a flex allowance. Um, basically, this is annual allowance of $500 to be used for covering uh, dental, vision, and hearing needs. And uh, the Humana Honor Plan is going to uh, be available. This is a great option for veterans. It uh, looks like a lot of their plans are going to be implementing this, or including silver sneakers as well. So if we look at it from an expansion standpoint, uh, the Honor Plan and the Humana Choice Plan are both expanding into 30 new counties. Uh, so disruption is always nice. Uh, from a network standpoint, all major hospital facilities within the market are in network and their PPO plans do have a national network as well. So that's uh, North Dakota in a nutshell. Uh, I think there's gonna be a lot of Medicare Advantage growth for this upcoming year. And we appreciate you all sticking around to learn about this market. Have a great day.